Hello everyone Good and morning. welcome to Let's Go Live. I'm Maddie. I'm Greg and all together now we, we are live. live. Hello with so many of you returning to homeschooling, Let's Go Live is of course back yes. and um, our first theme for this season is definitely going to pack a punch. Oh gosh, it's superhero week. Yes. Um, it's going to be full of fantastic facts and crafty crafts and smashing science and cracking quizzes and awesome activities. Mm -hmm. And I'm out. I'm, and I run out. Wow. For the whole family, of course. Yeah. And if you are new here, welcome. Let's Go Live is your live family science show. We started on day one of lockdown one and here we are over 60 shows later, most of which have come from our spare room studio, which is going, it's going through a bit of a make over at the moment. It's a work um, in progress. Yeah, some yeah. of you might see there's a bit of a difference. Um, but if you have watched any of the shows, you can catch all of them on YouTube whenever you like. Yeah. For season two, we are going to be bringing you three shows a week. Yes. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 11 o'clock live. Mm, now, before we say hello to some of you in the live chat, why don't we give any newbies amongst us a bit of a taste of what Let's Go Live is all about. Some of you have been watching back our old episodes and you've been making some of the crafts or have simply just sent us some pictures of crafts you've made in the past. Mm -hmm. So let's see some of them. Here's um, the first one. First of all, this is Josh. Josh, he made an underwater scene from Oceans Week and he's loving science thanks to Let's Go Live. Uh, here is Iris. Iris has tried one of the photo effects and made six versions of herself. Uh, this was from Magic Week, yeah. right? Yeah. She's looking forward to some superhero science. Point if you can remember what week these activities came from. Um, Bruno made a wooden catapult inspired by the time we were up on a castle wall. Mm. Yes. Uh, here is Jonathan and Rachel. Uh, they've watched the show since day one. Awesome. Here they are trapped in the glass for Magic Week. Lucy and Peter are very excited for more Let's Go Live. And they have made not one, but three door coasters since, we, since we showed how them how to make it. Three. I know. That was uh, Mini Makers. No, yes. door coasters was Theme Park. It was. Theme Park Week. Yeah. And last but not least, we have Ethan and Amelia with their take on pixel art. Uh, using Lego. Pixel art was when we did the show from the Computer Museum. They're really yeah. excited for the new week. Okay, so we're going to show more of those at the end of the show. But now let's say hello to some of you in the live chat. Um, first though, can we all say hello to Jess, please? Jess is the new Let's Go Live moderator. Hi, hi Jess. Jess. She's in the live say chat with you all right now. And I would love to say hello to, who should we go with us? Oh, Tower Hill Primary School in Whitney. My friend Mr. Hart says hello. Hello. <laughs> hello also to Freya and Fern in Chesterless Street. Uh, Reese and Callum in South Wales. Lucas in Whitehaven. Uh, Grace and Jack in Ashby, say hi. Hello. Uh, Joshua and Sherborne in Elmer and Oriel in Birmingham. Um, been watching since day oh, one. Sorry, nice. just cut you up. Uh, Hannah, William and Samantha, hello. They are, they're appreciating your new desk, by the way. Greg thanks, made this. Thanks, thanks. This was your weekend project, amongst everything else. <laughs> I learned some skills. Uh, right, we've got Lewis and Rowan and Bexy Heath, Finn and Ben and Paul, Edward and Adam in Colchester. We've got so many people Yes, watching. and Caitlin and her mum. Hello, you two. Uh, a few around the world as well. We've got wow. Yaya in Saudi, Ina in Tokyo, uh, Basia, Maria, Clara, Sarah, Marta in Ireland. We've got... <laughs> just you're names. Hello. Hello, everybody. <laughs> and of course, um, a huge, huge hello to you if you're watching live in a classroom. We know some of you are. Mm -hmm. uh, and also if you're catching up later. Lots of you messaged us to say that you'll be watching the show back. So hello, if you're yeah. watching back. Thumbs up from all of you and a thumbs up from us as well. Um, so the uh, the theme for our first week back is superhero science. That was bold, wasn't it? Was it? Epic. Yeah, yeah. Dramatic. And today we're going to be designing a superhero and transforming ourselves into them. Yeah, on Wednesday we will be testing some superpowers with science. And on Friday we'll be talking real life superheroes. Look, we want to know your superhero name. Let's start with this, all right? Okay. Not the names that you get in films and TVs and telly and stuff. What would your superhero name be? Uh, let us know in the live chat and we'll read out a bunch later on. Shall we let this lot know what our superhero names are? Love it. Let's do it. <laughs> okay. So by day, you might know me as Maddie Moat, but uh, by night, I am Agent Curious. <sighs> And it is my mission to get everyone in the world to stay curious and ask weird and wonderful questions. Yeah. Things like, um, hmm, why does lightning always come before thunder? Hmm. Good question. Now, who um, are you? Who am I? All right. Yeah. <laughs> you might know me 
as Greg Foot. Hi. Uh, but my alter ego is Captain Fact Bomb. <clears throat> I've come to save the day one fact at a time. For example, yeah. Agent Curious. Yeah. Did you know that each week your nose produces over seven litres of snot? I did not know that. Well, you do now. Fact bomb. <laughs> Whoa. Fact bomb. Wow, well, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Stand back up again. What? Stand back up again. Go on. What on earth are you wearing? Well, what? What? all superheroes yeah. wear their underpants over their trousers. Agree, right? Um, These are my super pants. Your super pants. Grab a photo. <laughs> I think you might need a little bit more than just a pair of super pants to be a superhero. Like, what about, like, do you have any special skills? <laughs> I've got pants. Have you got, have you got a gadget? Maybe some, red pants. Maybe some cool technology or, or, or something. No. 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 Okay. Fresh out right. of those, okay. to be honest. Um, interesting point. You make their agent curious. Yeah. Tell me more. All right. Well, some of my favourite superhero characters are the ones that could actually be real. So today we're going to focus on human hero, her heroes. Heroes. Heroes who get their... Humans crossed with kangaroos. <laughs> heroes. <laughs> who get their special powers from mental or physical training. Maybe they wear special suits or they have some really cool technology. That kind of thing. Okay. Obviously, yeah. the first person that springs to mind is Batman. Ah, oh, right? yes. Let me, uh, let me put up here a picture of yeah. Batman. Right? So Batman is known as the world's greatest detective. He can speak loads of languages and he's actually a brilliant scientist. Go science! Yeah. Um, he also has a utility oh. belt that's loaded with tools and gadgets, a Batmobile, a bat suit, and he's got wings to get around. How about... Black Widow, ah, right? Black yes. Widow, right? Yeah, good point. Professional spy, mm -hmm. yeah? Uh, you're one of the Avengers, of yes. course. Yeah. Uh, World-class gymnast, right. yeah? Expert martial artist and, don't know if you knew this, fantastic ballerina. Ah, graceful. Graceful, graceful. as well, though. Um, another one would be Falcon. Some of you might know who Falcon is. Yeah. Uh, master pilot, uh, helped to rescue people in the Air Force, but he gets his ability to fly from that amazing winged jet pack. So cool. So, so cool. You might be onto something. Yeah. My super pants might not be super enough. Yeah, there is that. There is that. But not to worry, because I've actually already thought about this. Of course you have. Um, I thought you have. that we could make our own superhero costumes to help us go about our superhero ways. Amazing. Um, I, you know what? I'm going to give you these first. Here we go. Something Thanks. I made earlier. Thanks. You're, no, you have no problem at all. You just slide them on. That's it. Pop your hand through the string. Put them on. These are actually our superhero cuffs. Um, that we can wear them when we go exploring. They help to protect us. Um, also, they'll help uh, people know who we are. You know, a little bit of branding. But not only that, um, it's where we can keep, you know, like questions up our sleeves. Or I can keep questions up mine and you can find answers in yours. Fact bombs, I think are fine. Yeah, yeah good, got, it. It go? got it, got it, yeah, fine. Okay, then hang on a second. Uh, watch this. Um, oh, how many noses do slugs have? How? Yeah, how many, many noses, noses do slugs do have? Do slugs have? Yeah. Um, uh, let me find the answer. <sighs> Four? Whoa! Fact bomb! Well, they work. That's How did amazing. I know that? I don't know. Actually, I think they're tentacles. How did I know that? <laughs> anyway. I told powerful. you. Magic superhero cuffs. Uh, but you could actually make these yourself if you wanted to. And we can show you how. Uh, why don't we go to our, our craft cam? Craft like cam. That, and I can show you simply how you can make your own, your own superhero cuffs. All right. So, first of all, start with a lockdown classic, A... Toilet roll! Um, way. But it could be a kitchen roll. I know that sometimes you can't take these into schools, but you could just use a piece of cardboard and roll it up, to be honest. Now, the first thing I would like you to do is get a pair of scissors, ask a grown-up to help you if you need some help, and you are going to cut a line down your roll of cardboard, like so. And then you get something that looks like this. And this is great because it will naturally sort of fit around your wrist. Perfect. But we want to put some holes in it. So at this point, I'm going to get a hole punch and make some holes at the end. Uh, if you don't have a hole punch, you could just use uh, a sharp pencil and some blue tack and you could make your own holes. Um, so you don't need to, as I said, we always encourage you to do things your own way. Now, next thing 
is take that bit of card and decorate it. I've painted ours blue and yours is uh, yours are red. Blue and red. Yeah. Nice. There we are. <laughs> like true explorers. Throwback. Anyway, um, so I've painted this blue here and now I'm going to throw um, thread some string through it so it looks like this. And that is simply by going through these holes. And that means that you can tie them on so that they don't come, become loose and fall off. So you can do it like that, like this. And then you are nearly ready to go. I've actually crossed mine over in this one. So there are different ways you can do that. And then lastly, I'm just going to use some craft materials, a little bit of glue, and I'm going to stick that on. And you have yourself a super hero cuff. <laughs> Oh, mine's twisted around. There you go. Oh, nice. Love it. All right. Yeah? Good. Shall we uh, share mm -hmm. some of their awesome superhero names? Oh, yes. They're coming through in their bazillions. Okay, fantastic. Um, Agnes says, Super Agnes. Harry would be Super Cant. Uh, and Maddie, not you. Galactic okay. Girl. Galactic Girl. Oh, maybe they really, really like space or something. Um, Abba says her superhero name is Amazing Abba. Nice alliteration. Always good. Always good. Um, and we have Amber says Super BB. Maybe they're like bees. Mm. I love bees. Uh, yeah, we've got another like animal related one. Oh, it's going to mm. link to our quiz yeah, later. It will yeah. Do. Yes. Uh, Emily has got Grizzly Bear Girl. Jake would be Captain Invisible. Where's he gone? I don't know. Where, who, who's Captain that? Invisible. Jake? Yeah. All right. So um, All right. these are fantastic. Yes. Love these. Mm -hmm. But what about costumes? All right. You know, mm. I thought that my super pants would be enough. Sit but down. Clearly Sit they're, down. Not, they're not enough. Don't worry. I've already thought about that. I just made has. you something. Of course she has. You're going to love this. I do. Uh, this is your fact finding armour. Do you want to help? I can help you pop it on. Oh my right? goodness. I'm so excited. You going in? I'm so excited. Very good. <laughs> Arm on. through there. Arm through. Edna Mode from The Incredible. It, you've got to stand up, otherwise I'm going to attach oh. you to the chair. Okay. Oh, oh, no, careful. Oh, you're not very graceful, are you? There no. you go. Uh, I'm you've never looked, look, hang on. You've never looked, you've never looked better. Wow. Wow. Hang, hang on, on, hang on, you're not finished. This. You're not finished. You're not finished? You need, you need a mask. Oh. There you go. Wow, look at that. Career highlight. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I've got to tie To be honest, it really is. Look at you. Yes. Okay, what about you? Hang on. I've got, I've got what about you? Hang on. Well, it's quite hard to see when you're wearing this this mask. What go. have you got? Okay, okay here it comes. Right. <laughs> wow, right. that is awesome. Here I am. I love a cape. <laughs> Capes are cool. <laughs> they are cool. Do you want me to tie yours? Yes, please. Thank okay. you so much. All right, here we go. All right, then. So, um, so you have got your armour to help protect you when you're going on your fact-finding missions. Yes. Um, but also, we've got masks. Uh, and these are because we know that most superheroes like to be disguised. Where's, so, uh, where's Maddie gone? And we're not invisible. That's, yeah, but that's not I, invisible. All I can see is Asian Curious. Oh, well, yes, very good point. I where's, see what you mean there. That Greg guy, I liked him. <laughs> he was I nice. don't know where he's gone, though, because now it's all about Captain Fact It's Bomb. all about Captain Fact Bomb. Fact Bomb! <laughs> Okay, good. All right. Okay. Where the heck are we? What are we I doing? I don't know. I can't see anything. Okay, um, what are we doing? Should we try our cuffs once more, see if yeah. they're still working? Yeah, okay. Okay, hang on. What we'll happens? pull out a question. Oh, it's quite, turns out, I love these suits, but it's quite hard to use the laptop. Uh, <laughs> so I, I can do it. Wait, I'm just pulling, I'm just pulling out, pulling I'm out ready. A, a question. Oh, yeah, sure, sure, ready? sure. Uh, yes. Here we go. Yes. Okay, so, uh, how many moons does Jupiter have? Um... Oh, uh, at least 79. Whoa! Oh, How yes. did I know that? <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. We want to know what type of outfit would your superhero wear? Maybe you could design it and oh. even create your own. We made ours using high-tech materials, meaning bits from recycling and a bed sheet. I'm sure that you could do much better. If you do have a go at making your own costumes from recycling and bits and pieces around the house, why not ask a grown-up to send us a photo? And you can always email it to us. Are you all right there? I don't, Fine. I don't know if you can move very well. Can't see. It's all we, good. we get all of the photos we use in Let's Go Live from our email. So just send them there. We would absolutely love to see them. Or you can feel free to share them and tag us on social media. This is us oh. on social media. Oh, my um, cape. Please do come. Instagram, Twitter, say hi. Yeah. Tag us in your photos. We want right. to see them. Um, we might need to take these off so we can see for the rest let's, of the show. Let's do a few more names. Okay, all right then. All right, Super in. Seth and Literacy Lily. Okay, we've got Olivia is Octopus Girl. Uh, we've got Summer is Sparkle Girl. Anya is Captain Creative. Mabel the Marvellous. And Mohammed says his name is 
the, the maker. maker. <laughs> Wicked. Yeah, he is Captain Creative. Yeah. He's a brilliant. Keep them coming in. And if you're watching back, yell them at the Ooh, screen. Super Seth and Literacy Lily. Did you say that yeah, one? Yeah, I did, yeah. Oh, sorry Love about those that. Ones, yeah. um, I'm going to take this off so I can see. Okay. Okay. I mean, yeah. Oh, Greg, where did you go? Oh, wait, hang on. Sorry. Um, oh, Maddie's back. Um, oh, Greg, there you are. <laughs> Key to comedy, timing. Uh, <laughs> okay. Right. Onwards. We've got the looks. Yeah. But do we really have the gadgets? We've got the cuffs, but lots of heroes use really cool technology. For example, mm. one of my favourites is, hang on. Who? Iron Man. Oh, I classic. Mean, whose favourite is not Iron Man? Tony Stark. Yes. Super genius inventor, excellent engineer, epic suit of armour. I think you'll agree. Yeah, and actually that is really cool because we are going to be looking at Tony Stark's suit a little bit more on Friday because the suits like that kind of exist in real life, which is very cool. Um, personally, um, I kind of like the superhero sidekicks or the scientists they work with yeah. that help them make gadgets. Yeah. And one of my favourites is Shuri from Black Panther. She is the head of Wakanda's science research programme and she designs those of her technology using smart materials, smart tech. Yeah. Um, by the way, yeah. I've been playing on some with something. I've like been tinkering. Right. Right. With a little gadget. Okay. A gadget of my own, right? Yes. And um here you go. What is it? Agent yeah. Curious. Wow. There it is. Cool. Uh, and here's mine. This is my fact bomb flinger. Okay. What you need is take yourself one of these cotton buds. Okay. Fact bomb. Fact bomb flinger, also known as a cotton bud launcher. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh, but here's the thing. Anything yeah. that this hits, right. I will be able to tell you a fact about it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Go on then, so, show me how it Oh, hang on. Yeah. Hang on. Oh, no, 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 no. No, that was a misfire. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, that hit the wall. <laughs> Go on then, Captain. Give me a fact the about... The Great Wall of China is over 21,000 kilometres long. Oh! Thanks, Mom. That was very good. <sighs> nice, nicely recorded. Oh, I had a fact for the curtains, for the lights, for the camera, you know, the desk, are, for the floor. What? These are a little bit like the um, snowboard jumpers we made in one of our Christmas specials, if you saw that, but like a handheld version. Mm -hmm. Would you like to show us how they're made? Can I move over to the making area? Move to the maker chair. Da, 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 I'm sure da, da, that um, da, da, the maker... Da, 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 hang on, my cape is stuck oh. in the chair. <laughs> Hang on. You're there good. You're go. Lovely. Hey, yeah. having a bit of space. Because right. cakes are cool. There we go. How do you make it? How do you make it? Give me a top down camera. There we are. So here it is. You can now see it. Mm -hmm. um, what you need for this make, what you could use are yeah. some of these craft sticks mm -hmm. here. Um, now, if you don't have any craft sticks, you could use lollipop sticks. Yes. Um, or if you can get hold of some wooden spoons, you could chop the spoon bit off and just use these bits of the wooden yeah. spoons. Even twigs. You're going to need four of them, and you're going to do one on top of the other, and one on top of the other. So you've got two pairs, uh, and you're going to stick them. All right, you could use a glue stick. Mm -hmm. um, we've actually used hot glue for a lot of our stuff, but glue stick. Stick them together, and then give them a shush with some paint. Give them a paint up. So there's one. There's yeah. one. Right. Zhuzh them up a little bit. Zhuzh them up. I, I like the use of the word zhuzh there. All right, now you need to turn it into uh, your. It's like hawks, right? It's like a. It's like a um, crossbow. A crossbow. Yeah, kind of sure. Thing. It's more an archer, but you know. So crossbow like this. Let's have a look. Mm -hmm. So we're going to put the cross beam across like this, and the uh, the, the shooty beam. <laughs> <laughs> the cross beam and the shooty beam. I don't know the anatomy of a crossbow. <laughs> okay. Um, like this, and then you need to glue. The two together. Getting glue all over my table, Maddie, just saying. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Very nicely like done. Okay, then what we did, we got some um, really thick cardboard mm -hmm. and we cut some circles out of the cardboard. Yeah. All right, you can see that like this. And we just stuck a, uh, a little coloured disc on top. If you don't have them, have a play with maybe trying it with some... Um, Lids. Lids. <laughs> I was going to be like bottle tops uh, or some... Uh, buttons would do as well. Yeah. See? Always one step further. Uh, uh, buttons piled on top, even if you want. So glue them on. Do -do 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 -do. These are going to help us launch our fact bomb flingers. All right. Like that. Yes. Now, the next thing you need is uh, a straw. Mm -hmm. Take a straw. Yeah. And you need to chop a bit off the end of the straw like this. So like a quarter of the length of the straw. Yeah. 
I'm definitely muckier at doing this than you are, aren't I? <laughs> this is actually Greg's first like proper make. We put you in the maker chair. Definitely for not two. <laughs> um, so you got your baby straw. Your straw then gets stuck on. Look at the state of this glue as well. God. <laughs> Turns out I'm the mucky pup. All right. So here's the key thing. Key thing. Key thing. One other key thing. Top down camera. Mm -hmm. is you've got to make sure your straw here matches up basically along the back edge of the uh, crossbow flinger, yes. right? Key. Here's the other key thing. Leave it to dry. Yeah. You've got to be patient. Yeah. Um, so yeah, you've got to make sure you leave it to dry for a little bit until it all goes nice and solid. And then you'll have yourself this. Let's take the elastic band off. So this is the last step. We're onto the elastic band now. So elastic bands. You could have Little ones, mm -hmm. like this. But you see, they're quite thin, all right? The thicker, the better. Uh, you might need to double them up, but I'm gonna use this one long one. Mm -hmm. It goes around the end, like this. Yeah. And then just because it's a bit long, I'm gonna loop it around mm, like that. Sure. Um, yeah, and then that goes under there, over there, round there, like that. Beautiful. So, so you've got one bit of it going underneath. Yep. You've got one bit on top. And then you're going to pull that back. And when you let go, it's going to fling forwards. Ah, nice. And we are firing. Can you pass me another fat bomb? I can do. There's a bunch here. Yeah, we are firing these. They are cardboard cotton buds. And you, how you fire it is you slide them through like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And you pull them back even further yeah. like that. You've got to make sure your fingers are out of the way. So there is a way to kind of hold it kind of like that. And then, good, great, perfect. Thanks for working. <laughs> uh, Thanks for working Whoa, again. Oh, hang on. Cheers, Tar. Pull it back and fire. Oh, oh. They work great. They They're really do. good. They do, actually. They do, actually. Okay. Do. We've got a game and they do work. We know they work. We've been playing with them all weekend. Okay. Right, Talk, Tell us about the game, Mads. Well, I thought to help us practice uh, using the fact bomb flingers, which we, clearly we do need, I've actually made us. One of these. Love this it. is our target practice. All it is is a box, and then inside I have hung three paper cups. I've decorated them with our logos, and then I've just hung them on some strings. So they're a little bit jiggly. Uh, what I'm going to do is put it over here, yep. and we are going to have to aim the cotton buds and try to hit the cups. Yes. Right? I reckon we can do it. I got one in rehearsal, so no pressure. Okay, that's going to They rehearse? Well, yeah. Kind of. Okay, that's there. How perfect. is this looking? Can, can, How we, is get, this looking? can we get a Bring shot? Bring out the target cam. Oh, perfect. Target cam. It's beautiful. Right. Nice. We're in focus-ish. Okay, perfect. Okay. What are we going to do? Three shots each? Three shots each. Okay. See all right, who then. hits them. Okay, I've got my three. I'm, I'm, I'm ready for the buzz. first one. Okay, all right. Go on then. Three, two, one. Oh! oh did you, did you see it? Just to the side. Okay. Just to the side. Okay, hang on. Hang on. Yeah, oh, hang on. Hang on. What? Hang on. What? Let's put some... Put some music on. Oh, nice. Okay. I'm going for my... Do you want to go for a shot for my second one? Yes, please. Okay, go for it. Go for it. One go on then. Time, one at a time. Okay, hang on, hang on. It's Philly, this, isn't it? You can do it. Come on. Come on, mate, this time. <laughs> oh, you need to practice your fat one flinger. Oh, missed it. Touche. And... Whoa! Did it, hit, did it hit one? No, it went just okay. above it. Oh, I missed again, missed yeah, again. I think we're going to have to just go for a scattergun approach here. You're going for loads? Okay, all right. Well, no, just one at a okay. time. Oh! Did it hit it? Did you see that? It went between two of the cups. Oh! oh! Yes! Good, good work. One nice. hit to you. One hit to me. We're just going to have to call it. If you're First around, two hits. If you're watching live, cheer us on. Come on. There's definitely a knack and you've got to practice. Yeah, you do. Oh, just to the right. Three, two, one. Oh! This is so addictive. Oh no. Okay, well at the moment I'm we winning. How long are we doing me. this for? Uh, good point. Oh goodness. Oh gosh. One. I definitely need a bit of practice. Oh! You got it. Did I? I think that tip just did the middle it, one. Did it hit it? I don't know if it did. All right, I'm going to do one more and then I think we might have to call it because I'm winning. So. Oh, I got one! <laughs> okay, it's one each. It's one each. It's one each. Pace is on. The pressure's on. First person oh. to hit it. First person to hit it. No! First person to hit it. First person. Oh, come on, no. Oh, no, it didn't, no. didn't fire far enough. Okay, right. Oh, okay, that's it. That's it. That's I it. declare it. you the winner. Well done. Oh, crikey. <gasps> there that was we a lot go. Of fun. Okay, so worth saying, if you are going to make your own uh, fact bomb flingers, try saying that quickly. Fact, fact bomb, bomb flingers. flingers um, or 
cotton bud launches, um, then make sure you don't aim the cotton buds at people. You no. want to make you want to make yourself a target instead. Um, More names. Hello to uh, Patrick, who's Wolf Claw. Fireball Toby, cool. uh, Game Master, that's Henry. Joseph is Speedman and Hannah is Lightning Girl. Joyous Jesma, Hannah is Dark Owl, George is Miracle Guy. And we've got Epic Ava and her dog, Super Ted. Love. And we, whenever we make anything, we always encourage you to sort of like try your own designs, tinker with it, improve it, just like Tony Stark, aka Iron Man would. And if you do have a go at making something like this, then please do ask a grown up to send us a photo to our email address. We would love to see your superhero gadgets. Maybe you come up with something completely different. Yeah. There we are. Um, you know what, Mads? Mm -hmm. We've got all the gear. But do we have any idea? Hmm, I think there's only one way to find out, Captain Fatboy. Agent Curious, what is it? It's time for a quiz. Oh yeah. If you're new to Let's Go Live, hello, you're very, very welcome. Uh, we always do a quiz in every show. And there's a quiz dance, which is just you make it up, go! <laughs> you dance like superheroes. This is me. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. Whoa, oh gosh, I hit the desk. <laughs> That's enough. That's enough, that. That's enough of that. Okay. Have you noticed that lots of superheroes uh, are inspired by animals and those animals' skills? Take Batman, for example, right? Batman was scared of bats, so he decided to become a bat to scare other people. Here's the thing, Batman. Wouldn't work for us. No, we like bats. We quite like bats. Yeah. yeah. Um, but also he moves silently at night yeah. like a bat. Yeah. Uh, and he uses his bat suit to fly like a bat. Mm -hmm. So... Yeah. We've got an idea. Well, there's another cool ba ga gadget, a gadget that Batman has. It's a and that, that man has. is his bat signal. It's a light that shines out into the city at night time. And it's how the city called Batman to be like, Batman, hey, we need you. you. Um, so we've actually made our own bat signal. Would you like to see it? Yeah, you would. Okay, we're about to turn the, the lights, lights off. off. There we are. Okay, I'm going to turn these ones off as well. So it's super dark. Oh, yeah, cool. Good shout. Yeah, nice. Okay, let's see that bat signal. Can you see it? Yeah, you can. Yeah, look at that! Perfect, love it. How cool! So we thought we would make some signals for other heroes, okay, yeah. that have been inspired by animals. And the quiz is, we're going to describe the superhero, show you uh, the, 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 not the bat signal, the animal signal yeah. for the superhero. And you need to work out what that superhero is or just what the animal is that you can see. All right, okay. Then. I am ready. Are you ready with the first with one? With our first question. Go Again. for it. Ready? Here it comes. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Now, this superhero is young and powerful. Uh, he has super grip and can climb on walls and other surfaces. Uh, they can blend into the background with camouflage, change colour, and even run on water. So, what's the who animal and who's the superhero? The animal is, and the character is, Gecko. Well done, yeah. if you got that right. Gecko, Gecko from PJ Masks. Okay, Mads is getting ready with our second I'm ready. one. Okay, here we go. Here's our second one. Okay, this hero uh, is a master archer and specialises in, in using bow and arrows. Oh, we um, mentioned them earlier. They have extraordinary eyesight which means they can see better than other people, right? They can spot their energies, they can fire with perfect accuracy. What is the animal? Also the name of the superhero, it is... Hawk, Hawkeye from the Avengers. And there is Hawkeye's bow and arrow, wicked. Okay, that's the second one. Here comes already, the third I'm one. ready, I'm ready. The third one, right. This hero can shrink themselves down to a few inches tall and at that size, they grow wings so they can fly around. Uh, they can also produce shocks from their bodies to sting their enemy. What's the animal and the name of the superhero? It is... The Wasp. Yeah. It's the Wasp uh, in the film Ant-Man and the Wasp. That was quite a tricky one, that one, because it sort of just looked like any insect, didn't it, from the light? Tricky one to cut out in uh, paper last night as well. Yes, it, it was. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this one. Uh, You've got two more. Here's the second to last one. Uh, this hero can see in the dark also see things far away, uh, and when they then fly, they create big, powerful gusts of wind, um, and they shoot feathers out from their wings. There's a clue, nice clue. This is indeed 
Owlet. It's an owl, and this is Owlet again from PJ Masks. Okay. I haven't seen PJ Masks, have you? Uh, I haven't seen it either, but I've heard it's great. I've heard it's very popular. We've got one last one. Oh, there it is. Okay, this superhero has superhuman senses, can even track baddies just using their amazing sense of smell. Um, they're very good at staying hidden. They're strong, they're agile, they can move smoothly with speed. Who is it? It is... Black Panther. Yeah. Oh, what a film, what a character, what an actor. You might have thought that was Catwoman, actually, mm. because it did look a little bit like a cat. So you would have got that right, absolutely. Similar skills. and um, uh, But actually, we thought Catwoman, she's kind of more of a baddie mm. in some way. She sort of becomes a goodie. She's misunderstood. Perhaps we could we could say that. How did you do on that quiz? Loads of correct answers coming in on the live chat. If you're watching back, how did you do? I'm sure you did super well and you smashed it. Good job, good job. Um, <laughs> we thought you could actually have a go at making your own make superhero your own signal. signal. Yes. Uh, so another gadget for you to have a go with. If we just go to our top camera a second, then actually I can show you how I did it. I simply cut out little shapes, put some blue tack on them, and then I stuck them to the end of a torch. Uh, we've even made our own Agent Curious and Captain Fact Bomb torch signal that looks like this. Oh, I love it. Hey, look at that. Oh, I love it. It's so good. A big question mark in the sky. Nice. Okay, lights coming back on. Screen's going to go very bright. Here we That's go. That's it. Whoa! Oh, well, the camera sorts out with that. Um, you know what, Maz? What's that? You know what they're also saying in the live chat? What? Awkward selfie. It is about time, isn't it? It's about time. We've got our gadgets. We've got our costumes. Yeah. I think we can finally do it. Okay. If you're new to Let's Go Live, we always do an awkward selfie every show. Uh, we get ready. You put someone in front of the screen and you get a camera out or, a, or a whatever, a phone, and you take a picture, take a selfie. Where's Maddie gone? Um, I don't know, but uh, Agent Curious is here to save the day with facts and okay, things. Hang on. I can't, I can only just it, about ready. reach. Do you want me to? I'm good, I'm good, I think I'm sure? there. Yeah. All right then. Okay, I'm there. All right. Okay, Do I've you got... want anything else? No, that's what we want, isn't things, it? Things, is it? I mean, I'm... do you want to hold up your flinger? No, it's all right. I'm going to hold up a flinger. Well, you, okay. you are the champion flinger, fat bomb flinger. All right, you lot, put someone in front of the screen or all of you as you can. Get ready for a photo. There's my pants. No, too much. Three, two, one. It's the awkward selfie, just me singing, that's it's great. the awkward selfie. Do, 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 do. Okay, all right. Oh, here's a chance Boom. for you. Um, get it with the fat bomb. Get it with the fat bomb. Oh, it's gone. Did you get the fat bomb? I'll give you one more chance. Three, two, one. With the fat bomb. Okay, it's gone again. Um, um I can't. I, yeah, we if go. you do take a picture, please do share it with us on socials. This is us on the social medias. Uh, please do share. Yes, so that almost you. brings us to the end of the first episode, but we do just have enough time to go back and see some more of the experiments that you've done um, uh, it, for past Let's Go Live shows. We're going to do a few more uh, live goodbyes after yeah, this. We've got yeah, a couple we of will. announcements as well, but first, yes, let's Ooh. have a look at some more of your UGCs. So first of all, we have Kaylee, and Kaylee, she made a dinosaur skeleton way back in Dinosaur Week. Uh, she collected sticks to do it, and she absolutely loves all of our activities. Uh, next up, we've got Iva and Betsy with their diorama from Oceans Week. Uh, Ivy wants to be a marine biologist when she grows up. Uh, Finley and Kian, they've joined in with every awkward selfie, and here is an image to prove it. Uh, their favourite themes so far were dinosaurs and theme parks. Uh, here's Georgia and Isla. They've loved every show. Here are their creations from Sprouts Away, one of our <laughs> Christmas trio of episodes. Benjamin's here with an awkward selfie, and this is also from the Sprouts Away Christmas episode. He's a big superhero fan too. And last up, here's Ava, who made her own rainforest den in her bunk bed and even included one of our super long snakes. Yeah, that was when we found out that a python could be as wide as a 12-inch pizza. That we left in the oven yeah. and forgot to get out and had Good to run times. down in the middle of the show. Remember, all these shows are available. They're all grouped up into themed weeks. Uh, they're all on the YouTube channel. Thank you so much oh. for joining us today. Whether you are watching from a classroom or you're curled up having a break, you're on the sofa or as part of your home learning, you are all heroes and so are the grown-ups. In fact, oh, yes. why don't all the little ones here turn around to your grown-up Point to them and say, you are a hero. You're a hero. You're a hero. You're a hero. Do that. I'll tell you what, you they really, really are. They do. Um, our next show is Wednesday, live at 11 o'clock. So not much, not much time to wait for more superhero yeah. science craziness. And um, we often get asked by people, uh, how can we support us doing this, uh, us kind of prepping this, yeah. this, this madness? So um, we've set up a page uh, where you can buy us a coffee. If you want to just like treat us with a little coffee. Cheeky coffee. 
coffee. Thank you for that. Dot com Cheeky forward slash let's go live. Um, but also thank you so much to our monthly Patreons. These are this is our Let's Go Live uh, family. They support us every month. So for any grown ups watching, if you did want to check that out, then there's always a link in the description box below. All right, and of course make sure you click subscribe yeah. to the YouTube channel as well. Um, all right, Matt. Let's it's say some goodbyes. To do a few goodbyes. Fantastic. I've got, I've got to reach this. I've got to do this and look at the live chat. Okay, <laughs> who have we got? Ellie uh, Rose is terrific. Lorraine Terrific. Bye, Ellie oh, Rose. Goodbye from creative to creative Cleo Zap girl. Dangerous Dotty says goodbye. Uh, Jack and Amelia and Kaya and Cayenne say bye as well. Uh, George and Lily in Glasgow. Goodbye, you two. Uh, Lucy and Peter in Cambridge and Phoebe and Bailey. Uh, goodbye for oh, we've got creative Cleo and Zap girl. Goodbye to you two and goodbye to Daniel and Ella. Did you say biscuit boy? I no. love that name. I, I, I didn't say that. Yeah, got, goodbye to Biscuit Boy. <laughs> Bye, <laughs> <Stay> Jacob. <laughs> goodbye to everyone watching. Right. There's so many of you. Please do keep spreading the word about Let's Go Live. Let's, let's try the cuffs one more time. Uh, hang on, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons. That goes <laughs> off. That goes off. Okay. It's good to be your arm, wasn't it? It's meant to help I, you I out. Can't. Yeah, it's really tricky. Okay, let's do it okay, one more time. Go on okay, then, ready? one more time. All right, one all right, more time. <clears throat> Why do Captain Fact Bomb's feet always smell of cabbages? Sorry, what? Why? Why? Uh, why? That is not true. Are they? Maybe not they're true, broken. Not true. Don't have the answers. Um, <laughs> don't have the answers coming out. We I don't know what's going on. We will see you again on Wednesday at eleven a.m. Until then, stay curious. Stay curious. Bye, everyone. <laughs> Bye. See ya. Bye.